I think it's amazing that we all get along, uh, get along well. We actually have our own inside jokes, um, apart from not only the boys, but the girls as well. And overall, I would say it's been an amazing experience. It's been, been, it's been my first time on a reality series and couldn't have gone any better. I've known this about myself that I am actually able to hold conversations with not just strangers, but people that um, I've just met, be it at events or parties or work related. But I think when you pull that out of context and actually live with them, complete strangers that you have no idea what habits they might have, be it good or bad. I think I never expected myself to see me in a situation like this. And that being said, I think I, I think I handled it pretty well. I would like to think so, and I wouldn't have it. I wouldn't have it any other way. I would think Adli is gonna win. He's been pretty popular among amongst all of us. Uh, he's been doing pretty well, I would say. Uh, looking back at all the challenges that we've been placed in, um, even even challenges that wasn't really his forte, I would say, or something that was super out of the norm. He seemed to have come out of these scenarios always on top, if not one of the top ones. So I would say, if, if I have to put my money on someone, I would say, I would say Adli. All right, just before I find out the fate of the six of us, who's gonna be the winner, I just wanna thank all of you guys watching. Thank you for this journey. Thank you for journeying with us from the time that we stepped through the door, through all the fights, all the dramas, all the tea, and all the excitement. Thank you, thank you for your votes as well. So, I'll see you guys soon. See ya. Today is the last day, the last dinner that I'm gonna be, last meal, and the, the last day I'm gonna be having with my stuck mates. And it's definitely bittersweet. I feel like this word is gonna be used by a lot of people. Um, because I am very excited to go home. <laughs> <laughs> because I have been stuck with them for a whole week. But I'm definitely going to miss um, just the day-to-day -day activities that we do together. Waking up and seeing their faces, doing my makeup and seeing Soli and Alyssa doing their makeup. And then after a while, the boy is coming in to steal food from our pantry. And when you live with the same bunch of people for seven days, they feel like you're normal. It just feels like they're part of your life already. So leaving is going to be a little bit hard because I really miss this experience. Um, but I think that this is not an end. I feel like it's a beginning of new friendships. And I actually am going to be going out with a few of them after this. Maybe not all because I don't know if I completely click with everybody. Um, but I'm very happy to have gained some new friendships. and. I can't wait to hang with them outside this apartment. The person that I think is gonna win this competition, just based on like mental analysis, has to be Adli. Because Adli was ranked first, was it two or three times in a row? I can't remember, but he's usually on the higher scale. I don't think he was ever like lower than three or four. So Adli is someone that I think will win. And well deserved because he is someone that is very hyper and sassy but actually he is a very very sensible person he's someone that you can have good one-on-one -on -one conversations with and he is someone that can read the room really well it feels like he can adapt very well in like social situations and I really appreciate how he had my back when I felt like everybody or maybe when I felt like I didn't have anyone that had my back, he was the one that supported me. Even if it's like just a silent like nod and like an are you okay sign. So he deserves to win. I think at least gonna be the winner. Thank you for watching for the past seven days. And when you watch, um, it feels like you know you are our stuck mate as well. So thank you for voting. Um, even if you didn't vote me, 
as long as you have voted for someone, I think that is supporting us because you're engaging with us and I really I really appreciate you for watching and you know being part of this show as well. And if you want to find out any more updates or anything, follow the, sh the show's social media page. Uh, and if you ever want to, I don't know, talk to any of us, follow us. <laughs> you can follow me on Instagram as well. And yeah, thank you so much for tuning in for the past few days. And you have seen us cry, you have seen us shout, you have seen us have fun, you have seen us clear the air and made up. You have seen everything. And thank you for that. Thank you for staying all along. And I'll see you soon. I would say that the feeling of you know knowing that everything is coming to an end um, is very bittersweet. I'm actually looking forward to going home and seeing my two cats. They're like my babies and I miss them very much. But at the same time, I feel like I've gotten really comfortable and like gotten to know all my stuck mates and I think I'm gonna miss them a little bit. If there's one thing I've learned, it would be that I think I can be very motherly. Like not in a I'm gonna take care of you way, more of a clean up your damn dishes way. <laughs> I think I'm ready to have a kid. Um, I think Adli has a very good chance of winning this competition and honestly I think it's well deserved. He's been nothing but truthful, he's been nothing but nice and helpful and he's just a really good person and you know he, he can come off as intense to some people um, and he can get pretty intense but I think that you know Adli has no has not a has not a drop of malice in him and I think he's the most genuine person in this house. So I have really enjoyed my time here on Stuck With You and I hope you, the audience, have enjoyed watching me as much as I have enjoyed <laughs> entertaining you, I guess. <laughs> and thank you so much to everyone who has voted, not just for me, but for everyone on the show. Thank you for supporting the show. And um, who knows, maybe I'll see you next time on something else. And you know you're gonna vote for me again, right? Like whatever I'm on, you're gonna vote for me because you know you like me. Hey guys, last day. Um, the journey is finally coming to an end. I'd just like to thank everyone. In general, I feel very uh, pleased that I got to take part in such a project. Uh, it's the first time that I had camera on me for such a long period of time. So it was definitely a great experience to let me overcome the, uh, the, the kind of camera shyness that I had before, perhaps. Um, in terms of it all coming to an end, I am kind of excited because I want to go home and return to normal life. Hopefully I'll be somewhere in the media uh, and uh, you know, pursue a career in, um, well, yeah, in, in that sphere. Um, the things that I've learned here will obviously, you know, I'll take them along with me. And uh, yeah, I learned that I can be overly calm sometimes and that I am um, when I when I meet new people I rarely open up especially in the beginning which can sometimes lead to confusion of other people so uh, moving forward when I when I'll meet you know new people I have to have a certain story to kind of share straight away that uh, you know, that would make other people believe that I'm not all closed up. Yeah, and I take time to warm up in a group. I think Adley is gonna win tonight, for sure. Like, I'm 100% sure, because he's just combined, like, for this, um, for this genre, his personality s um, sits in very well. He's performed well during the challenges. He's been ranked highest uh, throughout the days. He's managed to, you know, be liked by uh, by people. So there's, um, yeah, there's definitely a high chance that he's going to win. And I think it will be very well deserved. So, yeah. Thank you guys for tuning in to Stuck With You. Hopefully you had fun watching it. Uh, thank you for voting. Hopefully you did vote a little bit. And remember, 
that will live and learn. I think that it's really sad that it's the last day. I've really grown to love every single person, all of my stuck mates. Everybody has added some sort of value to my life, has taught me something, or has just been a really great friend. And I'm going to miss them, I'm going to miss all the positive energy that we've had. Like, despite the drama, I'm going to miss all the fun we've had together. And I think going back into the real world is, for me, quite nerve wracking because I've gotten so used to this. I've just gotten so used to this environment and this space and I like all the people that I've been stuck with. I literally have no problem with anyone and to go back into the real world and know that if I want to make friends or meet new people, it's starting all over again from ground zero and going back to, I guess, my home and my family where the energy is also different, not necessarily high energy all the time. As I mentioned, I'm quite extroverted and it's not easy to find pe like-minded people. So going back into the real world is a bit disappointing, I would say. I really wish we could stay here longer. But you know, life, life happens and you just gotta let go, move on. Something I need to learn as well, not good at, not good at leaving people behind. Adley's probably gonna win because he gets along well with everyone and even when he had a little bit of drama with Ray, I think that they're great now. So he's obviously managed to be likable enough or managed to, you know, correct whatever it was that affected her so much that now they seem to be on pretty good terms. So I think that Ali's gonna win because he just, he gets along with everyone. He has really great vibes. So I just wanna say thank you all so much for tuning in, for watching all of us these past seven days and I just want to say thank you for voting for me if you did I am so grateful and I really appreciate it because I feel like I came on the show to share a part of myself to share my story to be present and to share that with all of you and if you voted for me then I know that I've impacted you in some way or maybe inspired you in some way and I'm so grateful and I'm so thankful and yeah we'll see what happens I gotta go bye to be honest, this whole journey has been a lot of ups and downs and I really assume that you guys can see my character development from the first day as well as the last day. I feel that I have opened up even more and I feel that I'm more transparent towards confronting others I guess because as you guys know I'm actually a silent like confrontation confronter meaning that uh, if I'm not with you I will confront you but I'll confront you like like behind closed doors and things like that. But Despite, uh, uh, apart from my character development, I feel that the most and I feel that the most significant impact that has I received was the fact that um, I didn't thought that I would have gotten along with the boys because you see, the Luke can be a little bit of an air hole and then the left can be a little bit of a derp. But to be honest. I'm really glad that all of us got along really well and now they always bully me you know only that you guys never see off camera they were like do nasty nasty things man but I'm really really happy like I wouldn't change a single thing um, the relationships I have um, forged with all of the uh, all of my friends all of my stuck mates I really enjoy and I got to understand a whole new dynamic of people and personalities that I would never think I would get along because to be honest you know if you are outside there if you're not forced to live with one another you will probably be more comfortable hanging around with people that are on the same frequency like you know and you wouldn't think that you could get to get along with other people but now being forced to live under the same roof it's it has been quite a journey lah, and I really really appreciate it. Who would I think would be the ultimate stuck mate? I have a feeling it would be Lev because he has showed a dramatic increase in um, personality. Like the minute he walked through that door on the first day, he was so quiet and now he's like, <laughs> like he was he, now he's always like giving his opinions and things like that which is nice to see and I feel that mm, 
he has warmed up to almost everybody and I think that that increase and that difference that I see from the first day and the last day is really it's really enlightening it's really enlightening and, and really enriching. So good job to you if you win. Thank you so much guys for sticking with us and being stuck with us and watching us getting stuck together for the past seven days. I really appreciate every single one of you who has been through every single day. And thank you all of you guys who have voted for me. I really appreciate it. Now I will see the final ranking. I hope I win both. I heard got two prizes left. Thank you lah. Chill it, sweetheart. Oh. Okay. Can't have white wine. So should I put it in the freezer? No. Yeah, just yeah, the freezer for like. Freezer, okay. Oh, there's a bottle of in here. Oh, oh my gosh, I thought you were eating it. Okay, what? So. Everybody have a drink. Like, have a drink in your hand so we can, you know, Where's toast. The have a toast. <clears throat> oh, yeah, that's my first. Yeah. Oh, oh. in a can. Okay. To uh, many new wait, beginnings. Wait, wait, wait. I haven't had one yet. Yeah. Let me get one here. <laughs> right. To many new beginnings. It's yes. a pleasure meeting you guys, spending Likewise. this week together. Yes. Great experience. So all wait, the uh, everyone's here is a winner anyways. <laughs> right? Yes, everyone, everyone's a winner. Wait, wait, wait. Winner. Let's look at the eyes, right? So yeah. Yeah. Everyone have a good life ahead. Yes. Good. No. Good. I just, I just, I just look at me. Just look at me. Just look at me. Okay, let's see. Okay, okay, okay. Drink, drink. Okay, cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mm. I love beer. Same. Yeah. Series. Yeah, I do. Yeah. What's your favorite beer? <laughs> Lychee beer from Stalkers. Who? Oh, Stalkers. Stalkers. Yes. What is that? Oh, German it's stuff. a yeah. German beer. Oh, well, in that case, German beer is beer. Close. Close. Right, Close. 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 To clowns. To clowns. Hi, stuckmates. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna miss calling you guys that dear. All right, after seven days, we've reached the end of our shared lives on lockdown, and it has been an incredible journey to see all of your bonds develop right in front of our eyes, watching you learn about yourselves and grow together. Now, every single night, you guys also ranked each other from best to worst, and it's time for your nightly rankings final reveal. Oh my god! Hey! Oh, I yeah. Congratulations, you sure left your mark and won a quarantine stamp of approval from your fellow stuckmates. Now, you have no idea how much it has touched our viewers' hearts, and that is exactly why each day their votes flooded in to vote who among you they'd want to be stuck with. And now, we combine the audience's vote and your nightly ranking to come up with the ultimate stuckmate. So, without further ado, 
The ultimate stuckmate is none other than Luke. So hungry. Can we yeah. just get to the dinner That's table all. right yes. now? Yes. Yes. Good idea. Whew. Let's go. Wow. You're not a winner. Don't sit next to me. <laughs> Ooh, party! 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 party. This is so surreal because you know we've yeah. always been sitting here and now there's like yeah. it's fancy. It's so fancy. Even like the chopsticks are nicer. Wow. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. What is it? Oh my god. <gasps> I'm really really happy about oh my. my results because like, you know, I'm really happy I met you guys and Let's say congratulations to our winners. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Was it expected? Was it unexpected? Did you expect it? Okay, no, honestly thought he was going to win. Yeah, I thought so. I thought he was yeah, yeah, to be honest, I still thought that because the <laughs> one <laughs> 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 I also thought I was uh, we, should, we should like re <laughs> Oh, okay, la. that's why you can one 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 ma. Yeah, it's but true. I, 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 I really appreciate it and I really really um have to thank you guys because you guys have taught me so much over the past few weeks. So yeah. Oh, really? Uh-uh. Oh my my buffoonery. <laughs> <laughs> the biblical words oh, of Miss Sole. <laughs> Okay, yeah, but no, thank but you so much. I wanted much. to say thank you, Adley, for like teaching me a bit of fashion, you know, and like how to dress up and stuff Every like, morning. Recommending <laughs> things and like doing my hair as well. It was very nice, man. Thank really you like for it. curling my hair. You only me. thank you for the hair oh. and you don't thank me for the hair products. Wait, your turn. Wait, your turn. <laughs> okay. Okay. Jesus. Adley I'll get in line. Adley show, yeah. Thank you for the hair products that you've generously <laughs> provided yeah. for me. Oh, no, don't mind. Oh. Oh. It's empty. I need to get one more. Me? Yes, you. You must wow, know that you're like number one of my little <gasps> 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 Thank you. <laughs> you know, actually. Oh, 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 Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll get it. I'll get it. Okay, okay, well. Uh, um, let, let the winner, let the winner do it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> bum, bum. Ooh, what's oh, that? Oh, I think you should put it at the counter first and then you serve it to us. Serve it to us? Yeah. We know Thank already you. can do that. Yeah, la, of course. Must oh, be money yeah. things. Live, read it. Okay. Live, read it. Oh, okay, okay. 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 Now that you're at the end of your journey with your stuck mates, it's time you've you're treated to a nice special dinner courtesy of Kinky and its amazing fusion of traditional and modern Japanese food. Much like Kinky's ethos of being brave enough to change the game, y'all have been brave enough to endure seven days of, challenge, of challenges joining the competition to have a change of pace from your visual life. Here's to your stuck mates. Enjoy guys. Yay! Yay! Nice to see you guys. Oh my gosh. Guys. Look at the amount of like, oh my gosh, I love it. Yes. Oh, so serious. We've yeah. got soup. I want to say that mm. we've got all kinds of I stuff. love unagi. Thank yeah. you. Absolutely okay. love it's unagi. Super, safe. super good. Yeah. Yes, girl. Oh, Look at the amount of fun we have. Oh I'm so happy. Ah. This is it. This I'm is gonna, so good. You know, if I die such today, a treat for the last day. This is I'm what I've been waiting for. It's such a treat for the last day of the day. Yes, yes. Thank you, Oh, thank you. Wait, is this for the beef or the unagi? Okay. What is it? Salad. Thank you. No, I think this is for the unagi, is it? Let's see. Oh, I think so. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay. It's like a seaweed umami sauce. Do you want any for your unagi? I have one. Oh, wait, actually, I have one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Salad dressing. Yeah, it's for the salad. Salad dressing? Salad dressing? Anybody? No. Oh, it's for the salad. I want one. I've got it. Thank you. Chiffon. Makan! 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 Makan!
Oh, it's perfect. So it's perfect for the last I'm dinner. I'm so happy. It clears Maggie the palate. Yes. Okay, so with oil. Mm. Girlfriend. Oh, my. Jesus, Lord. It's beautiful. Honey. We have such an amazing it dinner really because good. everyone's a winner, yeah. right? Yes. We deserve beautiful. a treat. Yeah. Mm. Just start wrapping, right? Wrapping? Yeah. Wrapping? Walk um, away. I can wrap. Yay, love is back. I can wrap <laughs> presents. Chu fun, makan, yay! Ooh. Oh, that's a lot of sauce. You can't see it, but oh, why, why? I can't see rich and nice, not. Of course, of course it's nice, but <clears throat> so happy. What a day it has been. What a week. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. That. Mm. One thousand and first bottle of Ice Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what oh happened to the beer? God. Love your ice mountain though, Eli. Beer's gonna happen as well. I could die today. Mm -hmm. Girl. How's the food, guys? Have you tried? It is amazing. About to dig in. Mm. 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 Okay, your poche? I haven't ate. You have been rolling. Yeah, I need three months. I'm gonna need some fork. Girl. Oh, I'm so unclassy. I'm using a fork. Let me use. I'm also using a fork. Yeah, me also. I use trusty because cool. Lah. Try, try, try. I think I'll just try. I'm actually very in this decision, so. Oh my god. I could, I could die tonight, I swear. Oh, let me die with you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any more miso soup? Oh, there Do you want? One. I have. No, there's this one here. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm. Actually, you know the place is good if they have good miso soup. Mm. Okay, I don't want to get all sentimental. Yeah. But just realize this is our last dinner together. Yeah. No. No, it's not our last last dinner. We can still go out for dinners. Mm -hmm. I think okay in this in this situation. Yeah, okay. yeah. You know, I'm sure that the people watching would want to see us get together again Absolutely. somehow. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, maybe we can meet up. You know. Hmm. No, definitely. Mm. We should make this like a regular thing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do we stuck in a house? No. <laughs> Honey! No! <laughs> to meet up and have fun! Yes. yes! Oh my gosh, I'm playing charades. Oh, it'll be so fun! God, I'm gonna get more wine. <laughs> you mean grape yeah. juice? <laughs> you mean grape juice? Oh, yeah, juice. <laughs> Girl! Ray, what are you gonna take away from this game? Yeah! From this? <laughs> mm. From this game? Yeah, from this game. From these seven days. What are you gonna Competition. Say? What yeah. am I gonna take away? Friendship. Yeah. Besides the food. <laughs> I'm the gonna food, take yeah. away some extra weight on my tummy. No! For real, for real. <laughs> um, okay. <coughs> what I'm cool, gonna huh? take away is mm. how to be chill, how to have fun, honestly. And that is something that I haven't let myself do for a while. I know it sounds very sad. It's true. Adli. Yo! Who do you think was gonna win? Yeah, that I when, know. when Okay, everyone had their last confession, right? Yes. Yeah. Can we like our, all the answers? Like our last, last confession. Yes, yes. Okay, so who was your pick? Lev. Really? Oh. Yes. I felt Lev was gonna win because I feel, I stated in my confessions, like, full disclosure, that he, that he has um, showed so much vulnerability and like so much character development over the past seven days and I really appreciate that like um, I really felt that I couldn't click with him and I thought he was an, yeah. I thought he was an air hole but sooner or later <laughs> like I felt like comfortable hanging around uh, hanging out chilling watching Hunger Games blah blah, blah. and you know like that was a, a Actual jump from like zero to like ninety lah, let's say hundred. Wow. But yeah, I, I I say that you were gonna win. Hmm. You gotta say I got win not. I no, I said I said I said, I said I said I said you were gonna win. Oh really? Yeah. I thought you were gonna win. I said you were gonna win too. Thank, Thank you. I said yeah. that you and you were my top two. Lovely. Oh my gosh. You are my you are my number one. Oh. How about Ray? What, what, who do you think? Mm -mm. I actually thought that Adli would win. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm. But I really thought just because, you know, mm. three times in a row you got number one. I was like, yeah, Adli's going to win. Mm. And well-deserved. I but, mean, well. Although, look, I still 
feel that you deserve the win. Thank you. Like you deserve 100% because you have showed me so much about how not to judge a book by its cover. Mm. And I feel that this stereotype I have is just like a wall built up over the past how many years that I have been like suffering about people with like guys who are stereotype like you. You are so like um like you laugh with us like just no pretense I feel. Thank and you. yeah, I know I said before during one of um, the games that I at first felt that you were not genuine. Um, no, I don't think so. I think that you are very genuine. No, you have to say you were wrong. I was wrong. I was really wrong. Sorry, can, can you say that again? I was wrong. <laughs> For the people in the back. But Sounds the good. Back. One more time. Ray was, was wrong, wrong girl. Ray, Ray was, was wrong. <laughs> I mean, it's... It's nice. I mean, everyone, I'm sure, at, at some point in their life, you know, it's you just do what you think is best for yourself. Mm. And hearing stuff like that, it just, it's just nice to have validation. Yeah. And, and it's, yeah. yeah. And I want to say something that I observed. Um, you are a great listener. Not that we had a lot of one-on-one -on -one conversations, but what I mean is sometimes during group conversations, when I say something, and sometimes maybe, maybe some people don't hear it, for some reason, I don't know if you have really great hearing or something, you would hear it and you would answer me. And that's something that I realized. And I don't know, I just appreciated that. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I should be really glad you won. Yeah, but what, what are your feelings? Like, what do you feel? Yeah, how do you feel? I'm still, honestly, I'm still... In shock. Yes, I'm still <laughs> feeling overwhelmed. He buy votes, now. <laughs> okay, but continue. No, I'm, I'm honestly really, really overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. Like I said, when I came into this... Are they, are they getting a bit affected by it, eh? No, nah! <laughs> So close! Yeah, I mean, don't tell me you won't. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> Continue? Yeah, like you said, you know, um, I came into this competition, or what I say, reality series, mm. for the exposure. Mm -hmm. And I'm always open to, to new challenges. So it could have been any other five people mm. that wouldn't have been you guys. Yeah. Mm. Honestly, one person could have changed. One person could have changed, and the whole dynamic could have changed. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Everything's gonna change. This result is not gonna happen mm. at all. Yeah. Yeah. Can we make a toast to? Yes. Yeah. Let's make everyone a toast. over here. I really appreciate every one of you. And here's to moving forward and you know new beginnings. Right, right, right. Take and the <laughs> take the bottle. Take, take, Just take the bottle. Oh, my arm's getting tired. Yeah. Here's to new beginnings new and beginning. new relationships Woo! and friendships. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm keeping my stuff. Oh, yeah. and then we're coming back. Part to time, 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 part to time. I'm so dead. Lev, I'm so glad it's our last day. Yeah, Lev. So funny. I learn everything new by him every day. Yeah, that's why. Thank God not 14 days. Can you imagine if you had to sit, serve stay home notice with Lev? I would literally oh die. I would kill myself. What would you say? <laughs> By the end of 14 days, I would be sick. Oh, literally. But Lev, XOXO, I love you. So, XO. Oops, XO, sorry. sorry. Oh, okay, okay, where's the trash? Is this a trash? Yeah, it is a trash. Wow. We just, oh, wow, you finished your phone. I girl. do. Mm, oh, very me. good. Oh, okay, you're stepping. Ah! Oh, oh girl, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, girl. Alrighty. Alrighty. Party then. You wanna does somebody wanna send it outside? Oh yes. Yeah. Okay. It, yeah, okay. Okay, let Catch me, me outside, how about that? Catch me outside. Okay. okay. Sorry. Who wants to go outside? Okay, send Luke outside. can do it one by one. Okay. Send it outside. Okay. Catch me outside, how about this? <laughs> wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Mm. Okay, okay. How luck? Is everyone having this, uh, like, miso soup? Uh, can you put like the tissue on mm. here, please? I mean, there's oh. either outside or the fridge, yeah. so... Fridge, fridge, fridge. Miso soup as well? Fridge? Uh, I think you can just put it outside. Yeah, for now. Thank you, love. Have a Thank you. It's so amazing. <laughs> what was that? Hey, careful, careful. Slip. Slip and a fill. 
All right. Wait, hold on. This, 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 this. Oh. Okay. Oh, let me take the chopsticks. Thank girl. you. Girl, what is that girl just say, girl? It's how we teleport. Oh, into the yay! <laughs> Yeah. Well, can we just look at this photos that we took? Yeah. It was like on the first day. Yes. It was. Uh, this was on the first day. Look at us. Ali, I'm like pushing all my weight on you. Do you remember that? <laughs> oh my god. Can you guys look at this first picture that so we took? Cute. Oh. <laughs> look. Look, look at my BFFs on the first day. Oh my god. So let's look at part of our circle. Hey. Connery's lah. Excuse me. <laughs> So cute. And this sleeping photo. Mm. Hey, oh! Hey, what what's that? that? What's happening? Hey, oh, 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 oh. What's up? What's up? It's DJ Junior from 222 Arts Club, and tonight it's the finale party for Stuck With You. So make sure you get a drink, turn up your speakers real loud, and let's party. Come on, let's get it. Yeah. Oh my god. 